Alright then, let's go and give this a go, shall we? Well, this is a trail that I say I've never been on before. So I think there's an access point just uh, right on the other end. Anyway, let's see how far I get. Surprise, what a little gem. This is nice. I'm not sure how it's odd because there was uh, supposed to be a building on the right hand side. But, uh, there we go, let's see. People walking. Amazing, you go right in the middle of nowhere and you find you know, people walking about. I'll just go around here. I'm sure it's fine, but you never know. These things get churned up as well, so they? This is a bit of an adventure now, isn't it? Well, I'm sort of committed to it. I'm just trying to think now, this sort of goes there, goes there. Aha! No, there's no way I'm getting across that. Right, so, it might be a case that. This is the end of the road for me. to trail here. So let me see if I can find that. I'm 
nice, huh? Beautiful. Sweet corker. There's a tree across that, so I'm just wondering why that. Commit without. Okay, I can get up there, that's for sure. I'm running out of track here. Yeah, okay. This path has sort of disappeared, so let me get back to where I was. There's so many different paths, you see, so it's, it's actually confusing as to which is passable and which isn't. Uh, let me just see if this one is indeed passable at all. No, you see, I've. Nah. I'm completely off the wrong track here. Alright. Take the visor off. I'll just get back to where I was. I've got a feeling I should have been on the trail down there somewhere. Just hold up. Could have gone down there actually, couldn't I? Oh fuck. That's the camera gone. I'm not going to be able to get over that thing. So no, 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 no. Should be all right. Oh, no, that goes off into the, into the house. It's all stepped up. There's no way I'm going to get up there. Well, there is, but not not this bike. All right, oh, there's a quite interesting little uh, venture out into the trees, wasn't it? Is it that one or that one? Cool. Okay. Ah. Yeah. My, I'm not going to already see my pegs. I'm not going to get through that. Yeah. Uh, this is where you got to kind of know your bike, really. The pegs aren't going to get through that, so you have to kind of. Play it smart. Use gravity. Yeah. That's the problem. I was kind of, you know, 
footpaths are fine, but you can't. Well, they're not fine, if you know what I mean, but you really never know. You can get so far and you can be thwarted at any point. So it's kind of like, well, you take your own, you run the risk of going places and not getting very far. All right, should I try that offside? Let me try this side. I can always double back, can't I? Put the visor down because these they tend to flick up around me. Beauty. Yeah, that's where I went before. So basically, on the trail. to get the, the line just right. <laughs> and that was a bit, a bit testy, really, at one point. Because so many different so many different footpaths. I don't know, really. I know, I know. I shouldn't have been there in the first place, and yada yada yada. But you know, there's so many different options, and everything at one. I thought, no, I'm not going to get over that. I mean, I don't really fancy a really dramatic ride today. Um, so you know, getting over those. Getting over those obstacles and in and out of that was all worked out quite well in the end. Right, so. Okay, cool. Wow. Amazing. So this whole route, I say, it's only a few miles away, literally a couple, two or three miles away from where I live. And uh, yeah, it's not, uh, not far away at all. Go down there and see. I'm kind of looking at the map, you see. So I'm thinking, well, where does this go? Where does that go? You know, got to go explore. Got to go find. It's a tree route here. Just keep the momentum going, but also try not to stop going up a hill. And this is what happened the other day. I was actually going up a hill. Oh, I've had lots of gravel on it. It's about a couple of inches worth of gravel. So it's actually you know, the front tire was wandering anyway. But you know, the uh, just completely. I, I didn't attack it hard enough, and that's what it was. So I lost momentum going up, and it just well, it was a bit of a pain in the ass. We got with it. I had to double back down. So um, is this the way? Is it?
community. I'm mean, looking at the colours here. I mean, the sun's shining down. It's just absolute. Oh, look, you've got a signpost of where I want to get to. Oh, blind me, look at this. Amazing. Wow. Fair play, this is a beautiful spot. So I can go that way, I'll go straight, let's go straight across, shall I? Yeah. So kind of looking at my mapping again. You're kind of sport for choice. Which direction do I go? Which direction do I go? So these, you know, okay, I, I know they're wide trails, but at least I know that they're completely passable. Well, the, the trails before there, I was kind of, it was, I was, do you know what, I was in the wrong place, mentally, because I was, I'm in an R ring, which way to go, which would be the right place. But at the same time, you know, it's, you've got to try these things. You've got to, what's the best way to say it? Okay, you've got to feel them out. That's what I'm saying. Sometimes you don't really, you're not really sure whether it's right. So just feel them out, see how they go, see how far they go. And if it doesn't look right, or where it feels it, you know, it's going to close down, and then, you know, just double back. It looks like I did about 10 times there, you know. But, uh, you know, it's always good to go and check these places out. Wow, what a place this is. Amazing. It's lovely. I'm sitting right on top of the hill here. And uh, basically, I want to get over there. Now, I could have gone by. Uh, all I wanted to do this morning was actually just go out on the bike, uh, just go and get a nice coffee somewhere, and just chill out, maybe uh, you know, catch up on messages. But you know what? I saw an opportunity, and it, I didn't really plan it, so I've got to say that. And uh, I've just sort of been following my nose and following little markings on, uh, on the OS map and see how I go. And yeah, not strictly kosher, I'll, I'll give you that. But um, uh, um, that's why I like coming out on the dirt trails this time of year, because you, especially during the week, because you, you very rarely encounter anybody. And also, you're not leaving a footprint of where you are. So it actually works out really well. Let me just look at where. Look at this. Maybe I'm a bit of a tree hugger, I don't know, but I do love being in the trees, you know? Anyway, so there's a series of trails, uh, a couple of public access trails, a couple of byways, a couple of bridleways and uh, footpaths. They're kind of, there's a whole um, network, a labyrinth of uh, trails around here. And so it's a case of kind of trying to pick the, the right path, you know, to get you in the general direction. That's what I've done. Um, Wow. And the only noise is, you know, is coming from my bike, so. Right, okay, catch you on the next, uh, well, let's carry on, I'll catch you on the next one, it's not over yet. So I've got a feeling I'm not going to be able to get out of this, on this direction. Just had a quick look at the map, and I don't think it's going to work, but. Faith springs of, hope springs eternal. Let's give it a go. Do you know what? I am going to give it a go and see see if I can get there. I doubt I will. I really do doubt I will, but I'll give it a go. That's so, saying I'm just sort of I am follow, completely following my nose here. Well, in terms of the the trail, it's marked, but I say I'm. Uh, that's the thing with maps. You know, sometimes they they're right. I'm not saying they're wrong, but sometimes they're not as 100% as they're depicted. Oh, low hanging branch here. 
don't want to catch myself on that. Uh, yeah, you know, so sometimes you think, oh, there's no way that's possible, it's going to be a real thin footpath, and then, you know, then you get something like this, this is just like really wide. Uh, so I have no idea what it's going to be like at the other end, I must, you know, hasten to add. So I might have to double back here, because there's no exit point, you know, I, I could be completely screwed here, but there you go. So there is something going on here, it's just, ah, yeah, no chance. Yeah, okay, so they have, uh, they call me out on this one, right. Okay, there we go. See where this gets me. Oh fuck. See people in uh, high vis uh, waistcoats. Uh, best to get the hell out of Dodge. This is unbelievable, beautiful, beautiful. Which way is this taking me? Okay, down here. Oh, yeah. Nice. Going down a hill now. And it's all pretty solid stuff, I've got to say. That's a nice. I mean, just look at the colours through here. Absolutely gorgeous. fence there, there's the barbed wire fence. You too. Well, so I'm following this trail and I know I'm coming down off the hill but uh, I'm going to have to hope that I actually get out the other end here.
Uh, this has uh, turned out to be a lot longer than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> Probably won't have time to go for a coffee now. Crikey. Right, well, I think this looks like the end of the road. Yes, civilization, cars and building. Wow, that was really cool. Really enjoyed it. It actually ended up coming out on a place I do recognise. I've been on this last little bit before. So, um, you know, it could be that I've been on the other trails before. I've just come from a different direction. Sometimes, it's, you know, it's a bit difficult to see. But anyway, anyway. It was a great ride, whatever. I made it out. Hope you enjoyed this ride in times. Uh, it's probably going to appear a little bit disjointed on the, uh, the video, but it uh, kind of gives you a flavour of what it's really like, I suppose. You know, just uh, getting out there and seeing what they're like. Okay, um, so I suppose if the top, the top tip of the day is, you know, just feel your way around if you're unsure, but, you know, you know, just think long and hard before you kind of really overcommit to something and then you know you find that you just can't get out of especially if you're out by yourself you know if you're out by yourself and people don't know where you are then you obviously want to you know take it easy right catch you on the next ride in times whenever that is cheers now